Okay, welcome back. And I'm heading towards that dwarf guy again because he's the only one that can give me that trinket. That'll help me get past those sweet guards. And I remember those tombstone characters. Ugh. Almost forgot about that guy. I get back a little bit. Man, these boomerangs really come in handy. killing those tombstones. Okay, here we go. Found that guy again. Hi there. What brings you back here so soon? With a cute guy like you, how can I stay away? Say, Glug, um, I was admiring your work. And well, I got to thinking, do you suppose you could make a trinket for little old male? A trinket? Oh, you mean one of my skilled arts and creations. I'd be happy to give you one. But why do you want one of those? Well, the rebel army is blocking the way through the mine. But their leader is very fond of dwarf craftsmanship. So I was going to trade him a trinket for passage through the mine. Get it? Well, you're a good friend of Slick's, and those are hard to find. Okay, I'll give you one. Here, take this one. It's one of my very favorite pieces. Really? Oh, Glug, you're the greatest! I won't forget this. Be very careful with that trinket, though. All dwarf crafts have hidden powers. Okay. Time to go back to the guards. See if we can make it pass him. Gotta go all the way back down. Oop. Wee. Ah. Imagine how hard it will hurt. Just jumping off the cliff like that. A gift. Here we go. All the way up there. Wait, I gotta save this because... Just in case. Okay. Here we go. Hey! You! Did not make me so clear! You can't pass through here! Oh, I know that! I brought a gift for your leader. See? But I have to give it to him personally. All right then. Wait right here. The chief wants to see you right away. Get in there. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you, peasant, for your oh-so-humble gift. By the way, I'm Clavardin Clotsnipper, Leaf of Maple, Poopy Boop, and Bun Bun, your Kraken Lick, the Ratchet Face, the 14th Feudal Lord of Oderberg. But you can call me Lord Venuncio. How do you say that without biting your tongue? Oh, enough about me. Too much Venuncio could be bad for your health. <laughs> say, you seem to be one who expects big rewards for good work. I was thinking, do you want to join our cause? Sorry, but I'm really busy right now. Oh, that's such a shame. We could have used your help recovering the treasure. Treasure? Did you say treasure? Yes, you see, we of the Rebel Army are planning a heist of about three tons of gold. In fact, there's a strategy meeting taking place very soon. Hmm, too bad you can't make it. Three tons? Tons? Woohoo! Sign me up! Ah, my eager new friend. Right this way. The meeting room is just ahead. We'd better hurry. I don't see anyone here. 
What are you talking about? What, what's going on here, Venuncio? If that is your name. <laughs> you are so gullible. There's a reward of three million gold on your little group's heads. Or didn't you know that? <laughs> you can't expect me to let that go now, can you? Say what? Oh, don't play coy with Venuncio. I know that you are the three that destroyed Bountyville. Muttonhead told me all about you. Muttonhead? Ooh, if I get my hands on that flying old windbag, I'll wring his neck. Your pretty little corpses are going to finance my whole revolution. <laughs> but I'm getting ahead of myself. Your fate is sealed. All that's left is for you to die. And for posterity's sake, I do hope you die gracefully. <laughs> Okay, so we got tricked. Now we're gonna fly a bunch of fireballs. With happy faces on them. And it's gonna be tricky, considering... Uh-oh, the floor's crumbling, that's what that message said. And these darn fireballs won't stand still for nothing. Whoa. I don't think I'm going to make it. Ow! Ow! Ugh. Oh! You know, I'm gonna pause it till I get to this part again. Hold on. Okay, we're gonna try this again. Oh, further down. Uh -uh. See, the platforms are crumbling, which means I gotta do this really fast. How can I do it real fast if the fireballs won't. I'll have to get a little closer, do I? Uh -uh. Don't do that. Come on, fireballs! I think it's the last one, no. No, it's not the last one. This is the last one. Oh, cripes! Destroy the happy flames of death. Now, now how am I gonna get over there? Okay, by burning myself to death. That's the plan. Uh, get up there! Ugh! Ugh! Man, I'm talking about monotonous. Venancio! You mangy flea bag! Now I'm gonna teach you some manners! <laughs> so, you escaped my happy flames of death, hmm? What a clever feat for such a simple mind! Now then, if you know what's good for you, you'll stay where you are. You mustn't come any closer. If you do, it could be extremely detrimental to your health. Like I should trust anything that comes out of your mouth, you snake. Your game's up. <laughs> it's not like I didn't warn you. I just had this installed. How do you like it? Tell me, were you truly surprised? <laughs> oh, I just kill myself. Venencio, you dirty troll! I can't believe you got me again! You'll pay 
for this? Who will you pay? Yeah, he'll pay, all right. We are into a trap. Okay, since this is going to be a long cutscene, and I'm running out of time anyway, so I'll stop here. See you next time.